use the algebraic properties of vectors to find the following. So here we're asked to find the magnitude of the vector defined as the sum of vector u plus 4 times vector v, where u is the vector with components 1, 0, 3, and v is the vector with components 0, 3, 1. So here we go. The first thing that we need to do is find the components of this vector. So step one, find the components. So we'll use a little vector arithmetic here. We're thinking we need to take the sum of vector u with 4 times that of vector v. And plugging in what we're given, we have the vector 1, 0, 3 plus 4 times the vector 0, 3, 1. And by the distributive property, we can take this 4 and distribute it through to each component of our vector. And so this leaves us with the vector 1, 0, 3 plus the vector 0, 12, 4. And now by vector arithmetic, we know that we want to add up the like components. So we're going to add the x components, we'll add the y components, and then we'll add the z components. So this gives us 1 plus 0. We have 0 plus 12, and then 3 plus 4. For a beautiful final answer of 1, 12, 7. So we found the components of our vector. So now we need to go ahead and take the magnitude of this. So step two is to compute the magnitude or find the length. So we want to find the length of this vector. So we have the magnitude of vector u plus four times vector v. Oh, we could even say that this is the, or what we're looking for is the magnitude of this vector one, 12, seven. So we need to plug this into the distance formula. So I have the big old square root of 1 squared plus 12 squared plus 7 squared. And so this leaves us with the big old square root of 1 plus 144 plus 49. And this leaves us with a beautiful final answer of the square root of 194. So this is the magnitude of our vector.